Summer in Louisiana means really hot weather, and this morning we have an a very important reminder from the SPCA about protecting your pet in the heat. Uh, Preston Mesh is in with a cute little Shih Tzu, uh, and th this is a purebred dog, too. Yes, sir. This is Missy. She's a one-year-old purebred Shih Tzu, and uh, she was brought in by our Humane Law Enforcement, and she's now available and up for adoption. And you say she's calm all the time, but she has been so rambunctious. Uh, she, she's just nervous about <laughs> seeing you. That's yeah, what it is. That's what it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And uh, now, I noticed that, that uh, she's cut down, uh, her, her, her uh, hair is cut down. Is that for the summer, or just... Uh, it's a little bit of both the summer and uh, the way that she was brought in. Uh, she, her hair was much, much longer in order to uh, treat her. We just had to shave her a little bit. And Missy thinks it's playtime right now. Yes, she does. But uh, you'll see a lot of dogs around the city right now getting shaved uh, for summer. It's a great time for it. We are. Is it smart to do that? Uh, it, yes, sir. It doesn't hurt uh, for sure. I mean, I know my dog uh, was much hairier and he doesn't tire as easily in the heat now. Um, so when you take them out to the dog park or anywhere, you want to have them as cool as possible, put them in the shade, uh, give them water, just like you would with uh, the elderly or children. And a lot of times you see people who are down here and have, uh, you know, uh, huskies and other dogs that are cold weather dogs, um, and, and a lot of fur. That, that's right. Uh, we actually just saw St. Bernard come through our shelter uh, a couple of weeks ago. Um, those dogs are not really built for this climate, and uh, it is better to have them in a place like Minnesota. Yeah, mm -hmm. or to shear them or something like that, at least to help them out. Exactly, and keep them in cooler temperatures, like I said, lots of water and plenty of shade. And, and now, now tell us about Missy's story. And uh, she's ready to be adopted. Let me oh, tell you Missy what. is so ready to be adopted. She, uh, she is... Uh, she was brought in by uh, our humane law enforcement team. Uh, somebody called in and said they couldn't care yeah. for her anymore. And so we, we took her off their hands and put her up for adoption. And, and she's a little bit different because you guys don't get a lot of purebreds in there. We don't. We see a lot of mixes, but uh, every day at the Louisiana SPC changes, we'll have a whole lot of one breed one day and not very much of another breed the next so day. That's why I'm assuming Missy will be gone. In a heartbeat. Hopefully by the end of today. All right. Uh, so, so the best tip for for uh, for people with their dogs in the summer? Uh, lots of water, plenty of shade. Do not leave them in the cars whatsoever. No. Yeah. That, that is that is like point number one. All right. Thank you for coming in. We thank you so much. Preston, and, and Missy's going to be gone pretty soon <laughs> if Sally doesn't take her right now. Uh, <laughs> if you see an animal in an unattended vehicle, you can dial 911 immediately. Or if you're here in Orleans Parish, you can call the SPCA Animal Control at 368-5191, but the most important thing is don't leave your dog in a hot car. We're helping out 